is up guys welcome back gonna be hunting down some shrines this time this is on the let's play but this won't have a particular episode number or anything as you can see I'm facing this direction that right there is the Gerudo summit that orange tower right on top of my head is the Wasteland Tower. Part of the Gerudo Wasteland. But we're gonna head this way. I'm gonna be on foot for a little bit of it. Hey Daniel, thanks for joining in. And uh, we'll be coming up on a um, on a stable so I'll be able to pull my be able to pull Pongo out and at least get somewhere a little a little more quickly uh, so yeah gonna be looking for some uh, for some shrines and also some towers as well because any tower that I come across I'm just gonna go ahead and get it because I need to get it anyway no, I don't really need to that's the beauty of this game you don't really have to do anything that you would normally have to in other games. Pretty cool stuff. Uh, this right here is actually the Colosseum. There's a Colosseum behind that big freaking rock. And we'll check that out later on. And as promised, there's a stable right there. And, as with most stables, there is a shrine nearby. And as always, there's Beetle. He hangs around stables like crazy. I see a, what I believe is a, uh, well, I know it's a well, but nope, that's not a, I thought, I thought that one was a Korok seed. I was wrong. That guy's got a side quest, not gonna get that just yet. take Pongo because I feel like being abused but at least our bond with him is maxed out so he should listen a lot better now uh, hi. oh my lord and just like that it's raining awesome so Excuse me, puppers. And, if memory serves, I do believe there's a shrine up that direction. Yeah, it is actually this way. He's not going to want to do that. I know, dude. Camera, please. And there it is. Can't remember what this shrine is either. There's 120 of these. And my memory is pretty terrible to begin with, so. He is listening pretty well. He's not super fast, but at least he's doing what I need him to do. So, I'll take that as a win. Alright, let's see what we got going on here.
Okay. Oh, this one. Oh, yeah. So this one's pretty interesting. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what we do yep. we grab this ball. Okay, hold on one second, guys. My dogs are being weird. I'll be right back. Alright guys, and I'm back. Sorry about that. Dogs are acting a fool. Alright, so there's one other thing I need to go do. Alright. So now, <clears throat> what needs to be done... Is this and Zen get right up to the edge, make it in that basket, open this here door. Again, that ball rolls into that, activates this, and then shoot this one more time. Let's see if I can remember this now. Oh yeah, sorry. Some of this is coming back to me slowly here, guys. And some of it isn't. <laughs> so we basically have to do this. Eh. There we go. Alright, so that wasn't pretty, but it worked. And that's it. Shrine down. right along okay 
So the next shrine that I'm going after is in a bit of a weird place, but it, albeit a really creative place. Uh, <laughs> probably exactly where I would have put it. Are you kidding me, horse? Can you please? Thank you. And since there's not a trail, I'm having a hard t oh my lord. Having a hard time navigating. Oh, yeah. So I was going the right way. Um, I don't remember what I was saying. So, yeah. And as you can see... I'm actually, I'm, well, you can't see it, but I'm actually not touching the uh, controller at all. He's just following the, the trail here. And they'll do that once, um, I'm not going to tangle with that guy. They'll do that once you establish a good solid bond with him. It's pretty cool. Got some, uh... Red Moblins just chilling, picking up stuff in the grass and eating it. Guess when you're hungry, you're hungry. Now there is going to be an enemy that we're going to come across here that you guys have probably seen in some of my other videos. And there he is. It's a blue Hinox. And I'm actually going to leave Pongo right here so he doesn't get hurt. Or potentially get hurt. But, let's see. Our next shrine is right down there, as you can see. But I'm going to get this fella first. Need to make sure I've got stuff that's strong enough. Yeah. Should be okay. Let's hope. Boink. Okay. not have enough arrows for this. I am woefully unprepared. Oh my lord. Well, give this a shot, shall we?
super great, but... My aim is not great today. That's okay. Whatever works. Whatever works, people. Alright, we're gonna drop that. Hmm, nah. Now we can use that. I believe that's the first Hinox we've uh, come across and killed in this uh, in this playthrough. Yeah, I've. Uh, I think I'm having an off day here, Monica, and thanks for tuning in. Uh, not sure what's going on. I usually roll through those guys pretty quick, but... I think also not having the Master Sword messes with my brain a little bit. Takes away some false confidence, I guess. I don't know. Okay, cool. So this will be this will be pretty easy. So as I mentioned in the in the uh, first stream that I did today. Uh, this is a minor test of strength, so this will be this will be a cakewalk. Oh, he's gonna do the thing. There we go. Oh, I don't have any arrows. <laughs> Just kidding. Wow. Um. Come here, buddy. All right, and now you're done. Alrighty, so minor test of strength, super easy. Uh, as long as you're good at um, side hopping to do a flurry rush, as long as you do that, uh, it's pretty easy stuff. Let's see what can I ditch? Uh, yeah, I could probably ditch that. Oh my lord. <laughs> Hi. So that's another shrine down. We're going to spend a little time in the Gerudo Desert today, I think. Awesome. I need like two more of those and I'll be golden. Oh, 
Okay, let's see what the best way to get back up is. Probably just up that way, I hope. Yeah, there's plenty of ledges up that, up that direction. Hopefully we'll have a repeat of that one tower that I did. <laughs> that would suck. I'm not going to lie, that hurt my pride a little bit. Hurt my pride a little bit. But that's alright. Uh, let's see. Yeah. So I'm probably going to head for... The, uh... Wasteland Tower. And attempt to get that. Woo! Wait for Link to recover, and we're back at the top. All right, cool. So I told you guys that <laughs> there was a lot of climbing in this game. Let's see. Just checking comments here. Yep, uh, that is true, Monica. Um, just like when you're in ice areas, you know, you can equip uh, fire weapons to keep you warm when it's cold. Same concept applies, only it's the opposite when you're in the desert. Pretty cool, but we're not there yet. Appreciate the uh, input there again. Yeah. And I'm just gonna bypass these fellas. Yeah. Bye bye. here there it is it's taking a minute to render that was weird This one's actually really, really cool. I think. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. We're going to find out. Let us find out. Right meow. Oh no, this one's this one's <laughs> Oh awesome. You know what? I'm curious. Yep. Can't use amiibo here, so I am in dire need of arrows have to have arrows to do this shrine so let's do that right now I know how to get arrows pretty easy gonna be any arrows here. <laughs> that figures. Wait, what's that? Not what I need. Alright. <laughs> Another swallow bow. That's cool. 
That's cool. Yeah, we'll just knock out some of these. Yep. Okay. That works, but that's not really what I need. I'm gonna see if I can get some, uh... Just regular arrows. I don't need anything crazy or fancy or anything like that. Keep on trucking here. We get some arrows. Ridiculous. Okay. Save some time. Let's see. Actually, use this. Oh, this is the first time I've actually gotten rupees in this game. In this game file. I got one arrow. They gave me one. And look at that, man. That's messed up. They put an explosive barrel in there. Okay. Some shock arrows. Still just need some regular arrows. Oh. Oh, that's good stuff. I need to ditch something. Yeah, I think I can ditch that. That cobble crusher is really good. Awesome. Look how big that thing is. It's crazy. Use the two link. See nice! It's actually a pretty rare drop. I see some arrows over here. I wanna oh I wanna get them before they blow away. And fierce deity boots. Nice! Very cool. Very, very cool stuff in this drop. This is pretty nice. I'm gonna do a few more. And I'm gonna go back in and I'm gonna get that. Shrine done. Okay. Kind of a weird thing to get in, in a treasure chest, but whatever's clever, I guess. Don't need that. Okay. Do a couple more. And we'll call it. Maybe I'll get some more arrows this time. That would sure be nice. Hint, hint. Game. All right, well, I'm gonna have to take what I can get, I suppose. All right. Let's knock this out. So, in this one, 
actually have to oh no 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 well if I could hit the freaking thing let's try something different practice my parrying with this guy. Nope, that was way too early. It's alright, got it in there. Now. like that. Alright. Now this one, this part of this shrine is kind of annoying, but it's very, very doable. Just have to wait till those big blocks come back. Well, this one specifically, I can actually just follow this. Maybe. I'm gonna get. Yep. Didn't catch it fast enough. Gently drop. And then come on. Go this away. We just need to get past it. We don't need to do anything crazy. And just like that. Are you too good for your home? Alright. And bam! Another one done. These shrines are, you know, they're a mix, I would say. You know, all 120 of them. They're a mix of fun and challenging. Some of them are more fun than challenging. And some are more challenging than they are fun. I think they did a really good job. Uh, the shrine, I guess, design team. Uh, they did a really good job putting the shrines together and I you know I said in one of the other videos that the shrines kind of get some some hate so to speak um, people overall just don't really dig them I guess uh, I don't know I don't really understand that I think the shrines are a really cool idea. And they're executed well. 
you know, if, if they weren't executed well and they were just kind of hodgepodge thrown together, I'd probably have different thoughts, but I think they're very well put together. I mean, it ties the ties the game uh, mechanics together really well. Because in other Zelda games, you know, you instead of going to a shrine to get something to help you get hearts, you, know, you just randomly find them out in the open. Which I think would be super weird in this game. And it wouldn't fit at all. It'd be way, way too random. But who knows? Knowing the game designers and creators, the game designers and creators, if anybody could do it right, it would be them. Just my personal opinion. trying not to go too far out of my way to get shrines in this um, so some of these I'll likely skip um, let's see I'm gonna use something pretty hefty that's pretty hefty <laughs> Alright. Path has been cleared successfully. You're welcome, Gerudo Valley. I'll send my bill in the mail. Cause that was some straight up Department of Transportation type stuff. Why are you stopping? That's just crazy, man. All this construction and stuff, and if you watched any of the cutscenes, all this construction is from when they were digging up the Divine Beasts. And here is the next shrine, that fast. Really? It's just water. Come on. Now this, I believe, is electric based, like electricity based, so this one's this one's pretty cool. I actually like this shrine a lot. This is one of those sort of kind of challenging, but pretty fun. Pretty fun shrine. Alright, so there's a key that we need. Oh, hey there, fella. You know what? Nope. Alright. Yeah. 
actually. I'm gonna get my arrow. And there's a quicker way to do this. Because you can run at pretty much full speed while you're carrying this. With Magnesis. Pretty helpful. And that goes down. I'd be willing to bet there is a key in this chest and so there is all right and then we use that key to go in this door My guardian shields damage. Dang it. Alright. So, as in most Zelda games, if not all of them, they like for you to mirror things. Let's see. This one's not going to be an exact mirroring. Well, that worked. I'm not sure how that happened. I don't feel like I was that close to it, but apparently I was. There we go. All right, cool. And that's a big reason why I want to get hearts and all that stuff. So, little piddly stuff like that doesn't happen. Let's see. Almost a third of the way done, guys. Almost a third of the way done, unless my math is off, which it could be. Very likely. Very likely. Actually, on second thought, what I think I'm going to do is the rest of these shrines are pretty, pretty out of the way. I kind of want to knock out the much, much easier ones to get to. Uh, so, what we're going to do is before I go anywhere, I am going to see if I can get Epona to come out of one of these amiibo cards. So that is what I'm gonna do because Pongo's been cool and all, but he's just far too slow. Which is weird because I usually get a pony really fast. Yep. Let me see.
I just don't think this game wants me to have a pony. It's kind of what it seems like. one of my bows for that because that's uh better than what I have we'll just say that that knight's bow is actually really good and I've only got a few more amiibo to go here so I might as well knock those out while I'm here Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Yep. And hearty salmon. Nice. Okay, one more to go. And then we'll be off. And I think what I'm going to do next since apparently I'm not allowed oh my god is that a silent princess? wow I don't think I've ever seen that drop in a amiibo um since this game just clearly does not want me to have a better horse what I'm going to do is be a little more strategic about this I'm going to try and catch another horse. Let's see. I know there are some pretty decent ones over here. I don't want to go that direction just yet. I'm going to go back here. Go down to the stable and pull my horse again. I think this time we're going to head north instead of west. And then when I come across another herd of horses, I will uh, see if I can grab one of those. So we'll go this way this time. Excuse me, sir. And yes, there's a trail here. Gonna head this way. Check some stuff out. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. This horse sucks. Pretty bad. Yeah, as I was saying, 
they're supposed to stay on the trail, but he's just not doing it. Checking my map here. Should be a bridge up here somewhere. Maybe not. Oh, no way. Wow. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Later, dude. Okay, so sometimes when you save these people, they'll give you stuff. That's not why I saved them, but... Got away with a sword, I sure do. Yeah, see? So that's pretty cool. Gives you a little bit of extra temporary stamina. Nice little, uh... Nice little perk. Okay. Alright, Pongo. Alright. No, no. Yep, see? That's what happens. When you don't listen, like my kids, don't stick your finger in the electrical socket, and then they do. Actually, should be a shrine right around here. See, it's it's pretty tough because I don't have the map filled in. So yeah, it's right here. And I would go after those guardians, but you know just not equipped well enough just yet. Soon. Oh yeah, this one's cool. This one's really cool actually. So... open. I remember when I first got to this one, I was like, what? That's freaking cool. If I could just catch one of these, that would be great. 
great. There we go. Alright. And these dudes want to go. Love the mechanics of this game. So cool. Physics are pretty much perfect. I'm gonna need to dump. Yeah, I can dump that. Um. Gosh, man. I know there's. If I remember correctly, there's something nice in here. Yeah, nice broadsword's nice for sure. A lot of people prefer. Uh, two-handed weapons, I prefer one-handed weapons. Come here, buddy. Sir. Really? There we go. Okay. You may be wondering, what now? Well, I showed you. Can't walk on that. Well, you can. There's a way to do it, but that's the easy way. And it's effective, so I'm gonna do it. And here we get to use some gyro controls. Again. And I don't like the gyro stuff, despite it working really well. I'm not a fan. like that. Got it through. And that's three. We can go see Pura and get our stasis upgrade. So stoked about that. That's great stuff. And then there's this. <sighs> All right. So you can see what we're gonna have to do is this. Gotta wait for that. That wasn't too bad. I remember that being a lot worse. And then this one is pretty cool. Just need to wait for our stasis to recharge. And boom. Need something. Uh, let's just do this. Just 
just like that. That's a shrine, ladies and gentlemen. Now, I don't usually get every chest in every shrine, but this one I will be getting for sure. And you'll see why. Use that guy. Go around here. Yeah, definitely worth it. Definitely worth it. You can you can sell those for buku bucks. Alright. And bam! Spirit Orb number ten. So, trying to think, and I might do this, trying to think if there's a special item that I should get or should I save that. For later. I definitely think I'm going to go after this tower right now. So wish me luck. This is going to be interesting. That wasn't so bad. Good news is I can chill here. And the problem is there's no way to escape them at that at that point. Oh cool. They actually like started me on the tower. That was lucky. And <laughs> see, there's no, there's no escaping that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These guys are tenacious. For sure. But the higher you go, the easier it gets. So we're past the, the hard part. So, the rest is just that. And 
luckily. <laughs> Somehow it's raining and the sun is shining. Usually it'll pick one or the other, which is kind of strange, but whatever. We're here. And there it is, ladies and germs. Central Tower is done. Yes. So there are actually a lot of shrines in this particular area. But there are also a lot of guardians. And truth be told, I need to get to a better point of approach. for what I want to do next. But what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to go upgrade my stasis. So Pura, hook a brother up. Hey you, I did. Snap, snap, I said. Sorry guys, I'm just getting caught up on the comments here. It wasn't populating them for me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Sweet stasis plus done. Yeah, Monica, I'm sorry if you're if you're still here. I, I'm just now seeing these comments. I'm gonna have to leave the uh, <laughs> Facebook window open. I think. <laughs> Will do. Bam. All right. So. next thing we're gonna go back oh man wait what do I need to do here oh okay let's see I'm gonna try it it's not gonna go well but I'm gonna try it some of you might know what I'm about to try. Super dumb. Don't do this. If I'm treating this as a walkthrough, I figure I might as well show you guys what not to do as well. Only makes sense, right? Makes sense to me. We'll go with it. Alright. So.
Yeah, these guys have crazy range. Please go away. Why do I feel like I'm running faster than that horse? Speaking of horses... Some pretty good looking ones over there that seem like they'd be pretty good. Now, I think I might have mentioned this in another, uh, another playthrough, another video, but, oh, and there's a black Hinox right there, too. Of course there is. Uh, I knew that was going to happen. Um, the horses that have kind of one consistent color are usually better horses. Now I'm going to see if I can climb this tree while it's raining. And... Oh, come on. <laughs> Yeah, see, that's a strong horse. If it bucks you off like that, yeah, it's a good indicator it's a good horse. Ah! Come on! Killing me. I'm gonna get one of these horses. This will happen. Come here, buddy. I just want to be friends. Well, oh. that one's clearly not coming to me. Or maybe. Oh, come on. Ugh. All right. I'll find another one. This game does not want to give me a opponent at all. Or let me have a horse that's even worth a crap to begin with. This rain is just incessant. It just does not stop. If I remember correctly, 
and I think I do. There's gonna be a guardian coming around that fork in the road. And then there's another one kind of at an angle. I think like right here. Yeah, I believe he's in here somewhere, but there's a shrine here. So we basically need to cut through and avoid being seen. If I can get past them, there's something I definitely, definitely want to do. Let's see, where... Yeah, so there's one, then there's like a ton of sky watchers around. He's probably going to see me. Yep. Problem is, I have crap shields right now. They'll work. I can still parry and stuff, but they're not going to do the kind of damage I need to do. See, just weak. Yeah. I'm honestly, better off. that I need to eat um. right. hey come here Now what I'm going after right now, and I'm determined to get, is a uh, very, very special piece of equipment. Let's see. Let me check something here. So, what I'm after, shrine's right there. So I gotta, let me see, is it? Yeah, straight ahead pretty much. But, I do believe there's a guardian sky watcher around here somewhere. Yeah, he's right there. And I need to avoid him at all costs because those guys are really tough. Honestly, easiest way to kill those is just a ancient arrow to the face. Alright, so this will be... And I can't believe my guardian shield made it through that. <laughs> Alright, 
What's this? Oh, okay. Bet it's a major. Did I miss it? Oh, it's a minor. Okay, cool. That is fine with me. straight up. Well, that was weird. Shrine, or, well, not shrine, because we've got more shrines than that, but that is Spirit Orb number 11. I'm going to try and get to 12 on this playthrough, and then probably uh, call it a night, maybe? I might do another, another stream tonight. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Very nice. I just did the Kevin Malone from The Office. He opens up the candy bar and takes a bite and goes, Oh, yeah. Ah, I'm stupid. Don't worry about that. That's just me quoting The Office, which I do frequently. All right. Guys and gals, we are almost halfway to the goal. Almost. Okay. Now. Next adventure. And man, I really, really wish I had a better... Uh, better shield. That's the one thing I wish I had. All right. I don't think any of these guys come up this high, so I think we're relatively safe. Relatively. to do anybody that's played this yet let's see if I can remember I want to say it's over that direction yeah there's a chest over there but I'm not going to mess with it you know what I think I might be able to pull this off Oh, but 
like there's something down here too. Yep. Some of these areas I haven't explored specifically before. I mean, obviously I've been to Hyrule Castle and stuff like that, but... Um, yeah, some of these areas I've just never... Like, I've never been along this section of this wall. So it's actually pretty cool. I think I need to get to the other side here. Oh my god, dude. Can you not? I need to get down there. Now I think it'll be easier for me if I go back to this other side and glide around. So I believe there's higher ground and that will help me a lot. Oh, he's going away. Okay. I'm not gonna stop you, bruh. Little cutscene here. First time you come up to the castle. Now there's a, another one.
a little bit of a surprise in the stream. I honestly wasn't even expecting to do this, to be honest. Um, but we're doing it. Because why not, right? and then land one of those kicks. Kind of a
infinitely. Undid it. Undid it. Giant foe to be good, become recognized as a knight of the king. Look here, I'm already a knight of the king. See what this is? Oh, yeah. The one and only shield we will ever need in this game. That is happening. Oh, man. Now we're just missing one thing. Alright, I said I was gonna bail. I was not messing around. I'm bailing. And I'm bailing hard. Get one more shrine. Get one more. Give me a moment to look at my map and see where the closest one is. Okay. So there's actually one right here. We can go get pretty quick. We'll go back here and take the road because, if I remember correctly, it's not super bad with uh, with guardians and whatnot. So it shouldn't be terrible. We will find out. One more shrine to get. I'm gonna hit twelve. And he is circling around. I'm just watching him right now. Uh, there's one more shrine to get, and it's fairly close to this one. So uh, it's actually going to be right there. So we need to kind of go this way. And I'm going to hide in here. No shame in hiding, people. No shame at all. So it's actually gonna be. Yeah, we're just gonna cross this again. And get a bird's eye view on things. here
Oh, cool. Ooh, got a diamond out of that. All right. That's a win. Right over here. And I remember this one pretty well, actually. This one's uh, pretty cool the way they have it done. <laughs> that was not the right arrow that I wanted to use. <laughs> Thought I was going to be slick. Oh well. I'm only human, after all. Alright. I'm gonna break this stuff over here. Got some firewood, got some crates. Arrows. Would you get those, Link? Thank you. Alright. Cool. Man, I'm so stoked. Got the Highland Shield on this run. So stoked about that. minor test of strength. No big deal. Let's see what do we want to use on this guy. Oh yeah. Come here buddy. He's got a battle axe too. That's Target him, Link. Just like that. He gone. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> Uh, I was just talking about how I needed a decent shield. That's funny. And spirit orb number 12. Done. So, we can get three hearts out of that. That'll put us at seven. Um, yeah, I'll have to do the math later. I don't feel like doing it right now. All right. 
Let's see if I can remember. Hmm. Yeah, the only one I can really think of offhand is uh, the prayer statue is in Kakarika Village. Only one that's coming to my mind right now. So we'll knock out those hearts and then, uh, yeah. Starting to, uh, increase the strength a little bit here, people. Starting to get real. Huh? Huh? Uh, eh. Yeah, keep them coming. Alright guys, so, got a lot done, got a lot done in this in this stream. I want to thank everybody for tuning in and hanging out with me and uh, those of you that stuck around, thank you. Uh, Ashton, hey man, what's up? Uh, glad you joined. I'm actually jumping off right now, but uh, I may be doing another stream tonight, but maybe not. Um, so I'll keep you guys posted if I don't do a stream another stream tonight I will do I will definitely be streaming uh, probably earlier tomorrow earlier than I did uh, this evening uh, probably around noon something like that so uh, yeah thanks for tuning in uh, thanks for watching and and participating and, and joining in the conversation. I really appreciate it. So uh, thank you guys so much, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.